Oh, y'all must have thought I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> and I know I've been gone for a minute, fellas. But it's Detective Age and I'm back. Tell me why I've noticed there's been an abundance, an epidemic, should I say, of YouTube videos claiming to have NBA 2K22 gameplay and news that don't have NBA 2K22 gameplay and news. Yep, scroll down, just one quick scroll. Tap that big red button for me, fella. <laughs> if you've been faking it, I'm catching you today, fellas. Let's get started. You always wanna go on incognito so the government can't watch you. Okay, first of all, this is a fantastic thumbnail aside from the fact that the 2K22 text on the top left is not easily visible. Here we have LeBron James. What the hell? What's going on here? Why does this kind of look real? This is a gameplay showcase concept. Oh, it's a concept. Oh, <laughs> this is a spectacular concept, my guy. DB's 2K mod. He just dropped this. An individual did this, by the way, so when I tell you guys a whole dev team can do it, it's because an individual just did this by himself. Sometimes I can get a little bit excited on the job. Apologies ahead of time. <laughs> okay, as we scroll, oh, that's me right there. Hey, is that Badge Plug? No, no, not you, Badge Plug. No! Badge Plug, I don't see any goddamn NBA 2K22 gameplay! <laughs> as I pay close attention to your video here, Badge. Both the PlayStation 4 version I and see the some PlayStation old 5 version. 2K gameplay which remain different products separate games even Mitchell Inkrot who works for 2k when I posted this on Twitter in this title here you didn't say anything about actually having 2k22 gameplay but you got me <laughs> hey, it's been so long since I got a chance to be on the job man I feel so refreshed took a long vacation me and the wifey you know with the Kodak snapping some photos catching everybody in the act <laughs> This video is sponsored by Swing Dunk. Swing Dunk is a pretty unique take in the gaming spaces. It's dropping early access on Steam September 16th. Think about it like this. It's like hoverboards, but with basketballs. You can use the momentum of you swinging the ball to shoot, pass, and dunk. And lay up, dunk, alley-oop. It's like a combination of different gaming mechanics we've seen work in other popular titles all in one. You can use your hoverboard to dash and maneuver past opponents, hit them with a clean crossover. You could do it in the air too to get even more air. You could decide to play either solo or with a team. And that's either 3v3 full court or 1v1 half court. So on top of that, you can customize both your character and your hoverboard to make the experience your own. Oh, I haven't even told you the best part, fellas. The best part is that the game is free, so there's literally no downsides to trying it out. Click the top link in the description and sign up for the playtest that'll be going on from August 19th to August 31st. And the game itself will be going early access on Steam September 16th. The decision feels like a simple layup. <laughs> oh, I'm so corny. <laughs> hey, click that top link in the description. The game is free. It'll hurt you to try. Thank you to Swing Dunk for sponsoring this video. Okay, here we have NBA 2K22 Next Gen PS5 graphics gameplay. Get ready for some NBA action. Okay, so you mean to tell me that this is NBA 2K22. Does this gameplay look spectacular? Does the lighting mod look great? Does the graphics mods on the bottom give it a nice little vibe? ESPN mods? N yes. On the title here, it says NBA 2K22 Next Gen PS5! This is not that. I know, because I know 2K21 when I see it. <laughs> I know that dry, boring shell of a game when I f***ing see it, fellas. Why would anybody watch straight 2K21 gameplay? That is actually a form of torture! Look carefully, fellas! I think I got him in the act! This is modded gameplay concept from next-gen version for the next-gen version of NBA 2K22. All highlights are taken from 2K21 PC featuring modded graphics, shaders, updated face scan, scoreboard, and jersey. Did you need any more proof, fellas? Or is this right here enough? We got ourselves a open and shut case, Johnson. You've been caught, Yondu. You've been caught. And if I had any real authority, I'd make you pay. <laughs> God damn it, badge plug! Here we have another badge plug video. It does say NBA 2K gameplay, this time without the fire emoji. Hey, drop a like on this video if you guys want to get, um, if you love your mom. Wow, you guys would be pretty fucked up at this point if you don't do it. 34, 4, 23, yeah, minus all those, you get seven, and boom, Kevin Durant's jersey number is seven, so he bamboozled once again by badge plug. I'm doing your thing now. I'm doing what you do. This video is gonna be titled NBA 2K22 gameplay, two fire emojis. I'm one upping you. <laughs> I guess technically, badge plug is talking about NBA 2K22 gameplay, and I guess 
technically, Badge Plug never promised to show any NBA 2K22 gameplay. Well, then did Badge Plug technically lie? What the fuck? Is this a bloody fight with Pau Gasol? Bro, what have I discovered? This is a Nike Faller video. All right, I haven't seen Nike Faller in a minute. What's going on, Nike Faller? Check it in our first game. Stay classy, folks. Cheers, Nike. What the hell? Hey, that is a fantastic title. Oh my God. Hey, this is inspiring me to up my game, dog. I'm gonna be honest with you, as I scroll through here, there's actually not that many culprits. I'm not gonna lie, the only actual real, I guess, quote unquote, leaks that we've had is on TikTok, because one of the guys that did mocap for NBA 2K22 was posting about NBA 2K22. Yes, there will be new jump shot landings in NBA 2K22. Also, there will be dunk landings as well. But you know when you do the jump shot landings and I be doing the point to the sky and you do the, the peekaboo or whatever you got dunk landings now so when you dunk the ball and you land you got an emote that you okay talk to me talk more this boy asked was it real or fake news bro i work for them you ain't gonna find it for nobody else because the people that actually work for 2k not gonna say anything about the game they want it to be a big surprise and then when they tell us it don't be a big surprise just tell us you mean to tell me this guy did mocap for NBA 2K? And then he just got on TikTok talking about all the animations he did? Hey, he is not getting that job next year. <laughs> oh, look! He actually shows... Is this... Here's my dunk. I've posted this multiple times. Oh! I just bet money bleed. I got the gun in the screen. What would you do for some names? What would you do for some dudes? Go pick a cheese. Some of the cheese. Some people not good like Yo, that. Yo, he's sitting on them! He's sitting on them! If you dunk on me like that, I promise you, I'm retiring from the sport of basketball. There's nothing you can do to put me back on a fucking court, because I got shit on. You put dick in my throat. The 2K community isn't nearly as crazy as it was in years past. <laughs> I'm starting to notice that. Bro, do y'all remember how crazy it used to be a couple years ago? Man, there was no limits to what people were willing to say or do to get views, to get clicks. Oh, this guy is still uploading. <laughs> hey, I'm on your ass, buddy. This is one of the classic... The, the most classic frauds in the NBA 2K community, fellas. It's a little embarrassing because if you can tell, he's from Toronto. Pretend like he's not, though, all right? He refers to himself as the NBA glitch guy. Okay. Looks like we found ourselves a culprit, fellas. Oh, we're diving deep into this investigation. <laughs> okay, okay. Look, 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 look. He stopped uploading for a while. He was doing fake glitch videos. NBA 2K21 Unlimited VC glitch. Right into this, um, you guys want to go to the purchase VC screen here, and you're going to choose your VC amounts. The VC amounts I recommend are 5K and no. 15K. Anything higher than that is... There's probably a possibility no! of you getting banned. No! Bro, he's been uploading the same video over and over and over again for years. Are people still falling for this? What's going on? It's the same thing. You click on buy VC, then you turn your internet off, and apparently it's supposed to magically come into your account. But it doesn't. And dumb people actually try this. Well, let's take a closer look at this comment section. See some of these guys getting absolutely and positively bamboozled. This worked so well. I worked. It tries. On oh, God, it works. Oh my God, it works. I'm rich. Which one of you? <laughs> Fuck. Hey, okay, hold on. Pause. Pause. Hey, are y'all that dumb? You have to be a pretty dumb guy. I'm not gonna lie to fall for this right here. Who says that? The glitch worked, oh my god, I'm rich! And all the comments came out one month ago because he doesn't actually approve any new comments. He just has bots or his friends that go into his comment section and lie on his behalf that give him fake vouchers so that when you scroll into the comment section, you'll see 52 likes, this worked so well with the kissy face emoji. And then you're gonna actually try this. Bro, guys, let me, this is just a wake up call. This doesn't work. There's been a few actual VC glitches in the history of 2K. If you guys remember a couple years ago, there was a red ball, blue ball event where people was making millions of VC legitimately. The next day, 2K took all that VC back and banned a whole bunch of the people who did it. Y'all know 2K doesn't play about their money. If there was a glitch that literally made you VC at unreasonable rates, that's the first thing they're doing is stopping it because they want to make money. They're a money-making machine and you know that. So why do you think they would let you get away with this? But I say this though, undoubtedly, the award for the number one biggest bamboozler in NBA 2K history. Uh, we gotta see my guy Crashy Lion. I know y'all remember him. If you've been watching this channel for a couple years, you remember who this character is right here. Cause he was the inspiration for people like Hunzi. Uh, I guess he eventually moved on to Fortnite and started doing 
like fake Fortnite battle pass videos. <laughs> Alrighty, fellas, new day, new suspects. I'm on the fucking case, baby. This is Detective Agent, yes, Sirski. <laughs> now I'm gonna keep it a buck with you guys, okay? This hasn't been a good couple months for me. In all honesty, I haven't met my quotas, and my job is on the line. I can't, I can't fucking lose this job, guys. So please violate some rules, man, so I can catch you, or else I'll fucking. Fake evidence. Alrighty, fellas, NBA 2K22 gameplay. Oh, okay. Gento uploads this NBA 2K22 gameplay good news. You're not gonna trick me. No promises were made in the title. He's good to go, fellas. <laughs> NBA 2K22, 11 things you need to know before you buy. How do you know those 11 things? Cause we don't know shit about the game, my brother. What 11 things have you referenced? In fact, I'm curious. Some big stars adorn the various editions of NBA 2K22. The first is Luka Doncic of the Dallas Maverick, who's present on the standard editions cover. There's no way that these guys believe that of all the information that you need to know about a game before you buy it, the individuals on the cover is the number one thing they need to talk about. There's no way. With the new NBA 2K title comes gameplay changes, both big and small. Okay. This year's edition is leaning into precision jump shots, dunking in traffic, and the new signature moves and- Stop! This is, they just said random keywords, so you get excited. There's no way that worked on you, my brother. You are right, gameplay is important, but we actually know nothing about the gameplay. Is the point I'm trying to make, my friend? You're looking like you really just wanted to shit out a video and you didn't really give a f about what was in it. He hasn't committed any crimes. Oh, 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 agent! Rest in peace, NBA 2K22. NBA 2K22 will be delayed until 2023. <laughs> I believe NBA 2K22 is about to be delayed, and for re- it's a I'm sick of these scum baiting me on these news videos, man. I'm sick of it! I'm emotional because I'm about to lose my job, guys. And I feel like I'm taking it out on the wrong people. I apologize. It's just like we haven't gotten any news, man. You know? And it's like, and when you sit there and you think about it, it's like, hey, hey, man. We just want news about the video game that's coming out in two weeks. And we can't get none. Man. God. All right, guys. It's time for the heavy hitters, okay? NBA 2K22 official gameplay. Why don't we? Huh? Hmm? I'm about to catch some people today. Uh, NBA 2K22 next gen full gameplay PS5 concept. <laughs> I like how you put the concept at the very end so all the mobile fucking viewers don't catch that, right? Because mobile it cuts off at 50 characters. Smart man, almost worthy of fucking citation, but I'm gonna let you slide today because I'm a gracious gentleman. Uh, MB okay, NBA 2K22 official trailer. That's not a trailer. This sh right here is not a trailer, my brothers and sisters. NBA 2K22 my career trailer story concept. And I know this is not bait, but I kind of want to see what his concept is. Hold on. This is a pretty cool intro, my brother. Hey, can, can somebody make me intro like that? When I okay. was in jail, I was low key. I kept to myself. But every night in my cell, all I thought about was ball. Tragic story today, a 16 year old. Hey, guys, hold the f up. Why don't we hold the f up, guys? This shit is good. Get your popcorn out, ladies and gentlemen. Possession of an illegal firearm. ESPN had him ranked as one of the best players in his class. But all NCAA programs have now publicly withdrawn their offers. How did you get these screens? Your did mistake you ruined everything. I was supposed to make it. Move my mama out the hood, but I failed. God's grace, I got another shot. Y'all need to hire this guy because he just on the last decade of my career trailers y'all had dropped. Cause y'all my career trailers usually consist of you showcasing like Edris Elba or whatever celebrity y'all convinced to be in your garbage story. Why have we never done a story about somebody breaking out, of, you're making his way out of prison, a redemption story of him making it to the NBA, like, like, like an Allen Iverson type story. Why have we never dived into that, huh? Is fantastic, my brother. But I came on here to catch some crooks, you know what I'm saying? And we've caught some crooks in the past. I'm sure we'll catch some crooks in the future. But today, I'm here to tell you, man, this NBA 2K22 community, man, we used to be the most toxic. We used to boot people and swap people and f like fake accusations left and right and center. People used to link up and throw hands and threaten this person and that person. Even NBA 2K themselves have like put LSK's name next to a garbage can when they have beef with him. This is the most toxic of communities or it used to be. Fake video here, fake badge glitch, and fake this and fake that. We have changed! And that unfortunately means that I'm out of a job. 
it was my duty to make sure that this NBA 2K community turned back into form. And uh, I'm proud to say you guys have, man. So let me retire. Let me retire the jersey. Let me put down the headphones. And I want to deliver this message right here. You guys need to get more fucking toxic so I can get my job back. <laughs> Drop a like, subscribe to the channel, fellas. Hey, uh, considering 2K22 is actually a week away, two weeks away, I'm baffled, should I say? Baffled that we haven't received no news about the game 2k step up. Come on now We don't want to see no overalls. We want to see gameplay There's no reason why the most exciting thing I've seen in NBA 2k 22 related was from a content creator my guys Please y'all have the ammunition and that is the information y'all carry Tia come on, please Also, I was trolling about the toxic shit keep that in the League of Legends community, please or the CSGO community Do not bring that back here. I'm telling you that uh, that being said. I love you guys. I'll see you guys in the next video Peace